something here. Let's get it started. All right, let's take something. Let's get it started right here. One, two, three, four, one, two, three. Go! And that's the end of the ball game with the final score of Bath 42 and out of the team. Okay. Right. Hey, ran into a buzzsaw. stop. Right. He ran into a team that physically came out and they, they were ready to go. Right. A couple turnovers and, and that wasn't helping our situation as well. Right. It should be a learning experience for all of you. For you younger guys, it should be a learning experience of what you need to do to beat at this level of football. All right. For you older guys, Hey, we, you know, we had a good little run there, all right, and we got nothing to be ashamed of. All right, you accomplished something that, that only one other team in the history of football in Attica has ever accomplished. All right, doesn't always end the way you like it then. I don't know, we worked hard to get here, I guess. It wasn't what we expected, but that's a good team. that expected out of them. We got to make sure that we step it up a level to get here next year. I'd say, I mean, we play like D's and C schools, so we're not used to the big push. But, yeah, I guess it's a good learning experience. I know what to expect for next year, what it takes to be a step higher. I don't know, kind of everybody just struggled because we've never really ran with anybody else, and he's been our, like, highlight. So when he went down, kind of everybody dropped their heads. It wasn't good. Yeah, well, Brandon had a rough day, and then we put in our second team quarterback. It just didn't work. No, they, they, physically they just came out and they took it to us. You know, I mean, there, there's no doubt about it. Physically, we just we didn't match up. We didn't play physically like we did last week. And Class B football is about physical football, running the ball and being able to, you know, and, and get the ball downfield. And we just didn't, you know, we, we, we didn't match up physically today. Group, no, we, we haven't turned the ball over, you know, a, a lot all year, you know, and all of a sudden you get to the, you know, a big game and, and you know, four turnovers. That, that, that hurt early, you know, and then losing a couple kids, a quarterback, but, you know, and, and, and once Rudak went down, it sort of put us in a little bind. But, you know, I mean, we, we, we found some kids that, you know, I mean, Nate Berry came in and did a nice job rushing. And, you know, we, we just, you, 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 you got to be able to go to the next level. And, and uh, unfortunately today we just, we didn't have it. Like that well, you lose a leader, you know, and, and, and a kid who, who has as many carries and as many big game experiences as he does, it, it, it hurts, you know, and, and uh, you know, I think it, it, it gave us an opportunity to maybe find, you know, you know, Nate got some carries and we found some other kids. You know, we had a nice uh, sophomore came up and, and you know, and he, he did filled in and took some kickoffs and back and, you know, so the future's bright, but, you know, I mean, we just we just live and learn from this situation and we now know what it takes. Yeah, I mean, these kids need to learn that we got to get back in the weight room, you know, and, and we got to make a conscious effort to, you know, put more time in. And, you know, it's now football's a year-round sport, you know, and, and, and all your big sports or all your big teams are, uh, you know, year-round, and, and we need to get into that, that realm of things. I don't know, kind of in the middle, mad because I'm a senior, you know, I just didn't want to go out like this, but I thought as a teammate, we picked it up as the season went on and really came together last week against East Rochester and I thought we all played pretty tough tonight. Mm -hmm. but just didn't end the way we wanted it to. Yeah, I mean, we played real tough defense in the beginning of the game and we haven't had strong rush defense all year and of course these guys are, they play smash mouth football and they line up and they come to hit so it's tough kind of stopping them. I mean, Hutchinson and all and everybody, it was tough. Yeah. Uh, the football season really didn't go the way I, I thought it was going to. I thought we had so much talent on the team. I thought we were gonna. I, don't know, I thought we were gonna win a section of title. The truth be told, but I mean the feeling is great being in Paytech Park and only the second team in Attica history of sectional playoffs to come here. But I mean, it sucks losing. But I guess that's the way it goes. Unless you win a state championship, you're always gonna end on a loss.